Hi guys, I am enjoying my snuggle session with my two chicks, Molly and Pumpkin. They had a long day outside in the backyard in the pond, and I brought them over to see the chickens, the older chickens, and the bunny, and they were interested, but they're just snuggling up together. They're tired, and they were napping my hand, and now they're just moving out my body on top of my leg, and... They're pretty exhausted. It is really sunny out. It is 70 degrees out, which is really good for this time of the year. And I love that the chickens are taking advantage of the weather we got. And I have to supervise them 24-7 when they're outside because I can't let anything happen to these little chicks. They are just under a week and they are six or five days old and they're just cleaning themselves i noticed that pumpkin has long wings compared to her whole, her whole body and molly is little baby wings so it's kind of weird to see the different personalities they have and i don't know if they're hens or roosters i bet that this one will be a rooster but i'm not positive it just it seems like she has the personality of it right now and how her tail is growing right there and her wings and she's aggressive a little bit and she's gotten a little bit bigger than Molly. But I'm just afraid that we have a rooster on our hands but we don't know for at least five or six months. This one's still cute and still little but they're growing up really fast and I just love that they were just so cute together. They loved having so much outside time today and I'm just keeping an eye on them because I don't want them to fall off my knee. Um, but they are very cute. Look at those little legs and the little claws. They are so cute. But I'm just having a great time with them. And I'm just bonding with them because pretty soon they're going to be half their size of the regular chicken in a couple months. And I just want to cherish every moment I have with them and just to spend lots of time with them because they're going to grow up. You can see the neighbor kids or hear them because it's a nice day out. So that's why you hear the background noises. But I'm just having a great time with them. They're just very mellow and very sweet and just very socialized. Pumpkin is a runner. She likes to run around the garden and that is her instinct is when there's prey around, they better run because then they're not going to live when prey gets to them. So I like how their instincts are kicking in and, whoa, that was a close one. Don't fall off my knee. But they're just really cute. You can see the sun um, pounding on pumpkin because it is almost sunset here. But I don't do that, Molly. Don't. Look at Close up of Molly. Oh, what a good chicken. And then close up of pumpkin. Oh, what a good chicken. Um, They are going to start shedding some feathers soon but I don't know when but it's getting close to the time where it's gonna happen I need to find a box because they're gonna outgrow the cage in a couple or th three weeks so I need to find a bigger box because they're gonna grow fast and I need to move you to the garage in three or four weeks but they're still little enough where we don't need to worry about that yet but I love being a mom to these little chicks. Ooh, you guys make me nervous. Look at them. They love snuggling together, right? But I just love the stage. Oh, the newborn stage is only going to last a couple more weeks until they both outgrow my hand. Because they both like to sit on the palm of my hand. And pretty soon it's going to be over, so... I'm just spending so much time with them, constantly with them, and just letting them get some fresh air because it's really good for 
animals and people to get fresh air. And the sun too. Oh no! Oh, pumpkin! Oh, and sometimes they just fall off me. But they know how to land because they have feet. Come on, where are you? They usually get on my toes and I pick up my toes and bring them on top of the chair so they have a little platform to land and then they just land right here. Oh, that was so scary. But things happen like this. It has happened like five times. And this is kind of like a mini update, but I just want to capture what they're doing outside with me. Yeah, you guys are so crazy. Don't push each other off my leg. Yeah, I need to give you a nap because you guys are tired. But they're just little puff balls. Oh, I don't know what's happening, but they're just so cute. So cute. Um what else? Look at look at that wing. I'm gonna show you. Okay. I'm gonna move this chicken down. I only have one hand and it's hard with one hand. Um but look at her wingspan. That is her wing wingspan when she is six days old. That is as big as her body. And then she's growing a little tail right there. And this one, little Molly, is growing a tiny, tiny wing. Not as big as pumpkin, but you can see the colors coming out of her. But they're just so darn cute. So I'm falling in love each day. I don't know how it's possible, but they're just so perfect in my family. I think the adult chickens will get a hang of the chirping and me being in the backyard with them and probably accept them as new roommates. But I'm so nervous. I don't know what's going to happen. It's a long ways away, but I just love that they get to hang out outside. So I think that's it. But look at them. I'm going to turn the camera around so you can see us together. Look at them. They're just so cute. But they they are. They're right here. I can still hold them with one hand. The both of them. But pretty soon they're going to outgrow it. But they love hanging out in the pond. And the pond is so tall that they can't jump out yet. But I usually just place them down like that. And they just hang out and eat all the bugs and dirt and weeds here and oh you have a little itch but i just love them and they just hang out in the pond this is their first week of life so I'm just so proud of them. Thank you so much for watching this video. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys. Bye Molly and Pumpkin. Oh. You see something? Yeah. Oh, Don't fight over that. I want to like separate you guys. So we don't get fighting over that little thing. Okay, adios.